all of this from zero to pi. So first thing we want to do is integrate one and sine. So we end up with x, and then the integral of sine is equal to negative cosine of x. So next, what, what happens here is um, going from zero to pi, plug these in, we end up with pi minus the cosine of pi minus zero minus the cosine of zero, which is actually a value. So we end up with pi minus negative one minus cosine of zero is one, so negative one. So a lot of canceling here, so we get pi plus one on the outside here, and this becomes minus negative pi, so plus one. So we end up with pi plus two, and that's it. Okay, I hope this helped you out. Appreciate you watching the video, and you have yourself a great day.